Hi, this is Alan McKay, and I'm really excited for video two. So this is going to be a very complex fluid-based lesson. We're going to go through creating a plasma effect that has very intricate and unique motion to it by building it upon lots of complex particle systems that uh, really build up the entire effect. Now, a bit of backstory, what I've done is in video one of this free crash course that I'm building called Plasma, we went through creating a 3D volumetric shader and building a lot of really complex motion all driven specifically from the shader itself. Now what we're doing is we're building an additional layer of this and this is going to be the fringe effect. So in other words, this is going to be swirling and building up a lot of the outer edge. Building a lot of secondary motion, I think that's really critical because as complex as we can make a shader by itself, at the end of the day, it's just a sphere that we've built all of this around. So this is where we take it a step further. By building up additional layers, we begin to get a lot of complex motion that isn't repetitive, it isn't uniform, it's very dynamic, and we're able to begin to build up a more complicated effect. Now, I think for effects artists, we always need to learn to composite. We also need to learn to kind of build tools and automate where we can. So all of this stuff we're gonna be getting into in these lessons. If you're not a part of this training yet, it's free. You can sign up right now. Just go to alamckay.com slash plasma. It's available until June 24. After that, it is gone for good. So this is your chance to be a part of this. This is video two I'm really excited about. There's gonna be seven videos spanning over a bit over eight hours of training. Uh, I'm excited about this and I can't wait to see what you can create with this training. So get in on this course and join us as we go through creating this entire visual effects shot from start to finish. alanmckay.com slash plasma.